Hello everybody, it is the Raven Knight here coming at you with a very quick update video. I don't have a lot of time because I do work this morning, so I maybe have like a little bit of time to really work on this, so let's not waste any time and jump right into the good stuff. So first of all, my hand is almost back to normal, which is good, guys. That means that I can uh, work a little bit better and game a little bit more. The problem is uh, now that it's getting back to now that it's getting back to normal, work is probably gonna, yeah, like I said, work me even harder. So all right, you have no excuses now. Back to the whole grind, you know, and pff, I can't wait for that, right? Um, but hey, no, you know what? It is still a good thing. My hand feels a lot better, so. Um, I just feel like I can do a lot more. So expect me to be gaming some more, making some more stuff, and working a little bit faster, but still doing that reasonably, you know, with work and all that. So all that stuff is good. Moving on. Uh, something that I wanted to do, uh, what I originally wanted to do in my update videos was I also wanted to talk about, like, uh, stuff that we've seen in the Ravens writing room and uh, shout outs and all that kind of stuff but something that came up to me was I don't have as many things to shout out as I would like because a lot of the, what I have are textbooks and websites and stuff and I can only shout out just a few of those and make it sound interesting especially since some of these textbooks are ungodly expensive and I know y'all don't want to spend money on those some of them are just leftover textbooks from when I was in college so one thing that I also want to do in some of my update videos is do something I call story sharing, which is basically where I share with you guys some of the stories that I've worked on and written. That way I'm not dedicating a whole video to it, and y'all get to hear a little bit more about some of my story ideas. So today I want to tell you about one of my stories that you've seen a few pictures for, and I'll put them up here, is Troy and Frost. Now Troy and Frost is a story that was uh, done mostly as a favor to my artist friend Jay. Um, he goes by the artist Jay, but he's an awesome, awesome guy. He's a very talented comic book style artist, and I've seen a lot of his work. It's phenomenal. He's a Christian like me, so we often talk about spiritual matters and spiritual stuff, which is really worthwhile. It's awesome whenever I get to talk to him about that kind of stuff. But Troy and Frost was an idea he had. Well, more like his idea was James Troy, and that was his character, but he didn't know what to do with James, and I had a character named Elizabeth Frost, and I had no idea what to do with her, so we ended up converging the two ideas and forming it into a long detective noir story. The story takes place in the late 1930s, and at this point in time, uh, the World War II thing is getting started in the European theater, but America hasn't quite gotten involved yet, so... Um, we have a situation where the Nazis might be planning a covert attack in America, like a kind of a sabotage attack to convince America not to get involved. Troy and Frost get some information about it, and they have to uh, find a way to expose this and stop it. It's really cool because I'm getting to play with a lot of elements that I enjoy, particularly noir-style story. Um, I love noir. I love that very dark, gritty kind of detective drama. It's very fun. It's a very cool story. Uh, I've been asked if I would read it out loud at some point. I might read a snippet of it out loud sometime, but we'll see. But that's one of my stories that I've been working on. Let me know what you think about that in the comment section. All right, so now the real thing that y'all came here for, the video order as I know it. Now, this is just a rough list, and it's subject to change at any time, but here's what I'm planning so far. So the next big video you're going to get is Fantastical History Lamia. I've already started the script on that. It's going well. I've got most of the pictures and footage I want for that. We'll see how that goes. Uh, number two, uh, this Metro reader is upset with Ghost of Tsushima, a response video. So I saw this video, um, it wasn't even a video, it was an article um, from Metro UK and they kind of let their readers and editors write their own stuff and insert their own things. And this person was saying that Days Gone isn't the worst Sony game. Ghost of Tsushima is, and he goes on this short article spiel about how Ghost of Tsushima is terrible, it's bloated, it's, uh, it's just really bad. Uh, this was actually shown to me by one of my Discord followers. After reading it, I'm like, I gotta respond to this. So expect that coming up. Number three, Heroes in History, Aramusha. We will finally get to the Aramusha Heroes in History. Really excited for that. Gonna be fun. I know you all want to hear me talk about Aramusha, especially after his new update. Uh, number four, we're gonna get into For Honor and Glory again. It's time to do the next chapter of that. I've been itching to do it, but a lot of other stuff has come up, so look forward to that. I'll give you a small hint about it. It's gonna be heavily Viking-focused, so look forward to that and then finally another raven's writing room uh probably going to be something small but uh i want to talk to y'all a little bit about plot pacing i want to talk to you about story pacing and how to do that properly so look forward to that as well got a lot of stuff planned out guys and like i said some of this is subject to change and maybe i'll throw in a short story or death diary entry here and there because i like working on those even if y'all aren't big fans of them hey I, I do what i want you know it's one of those things 
All right, so some other big news, and then we'll wrap this up. So if I didn't mention it before, I'm going to mention it now. Next month, my military cousin, I have two cousins in the military, but one of them uh, named Sam is getting married. He is getting married in Washington, D.C. It's going to be a whole big thing. They were actually planning this last year, but COVID put a halter on that. But we're finally going through with it, and I'm going to be traveling up to D.C., um, mid to late July to go celebrate his wedding and wedding and uh, all that fun stuff. But that, but it's going to be almost a week long visit. So I'm going to be nowhere near my PC or PlayStation or anything like that. I'm not going to be able to work on stuff or play anything or make videos. So it's going to be a bit of a break. The reason I tell you this is because it's going to be close to, if not on the same time frame as when the new hero drops. Because of that, I'm probably going to have a late response to the new hero probably not going to see him right away which really bums me out i really want to get right to him and tell y'all what i think of him but it's probably going to have to wait guys i don't know we'll have to see so just be aware that i may take a little bit longer reacting to this hero than most other people but trust me i am super excited for that all right so now let me ask y'all a question what's your favorite content that i release i'm very curious because i release a lot of different content i know that for honor is my most popular thing it's what everyone comes to watch but i'm curious is there anything else y'all enjoy me releasing raven's writing rooms uh my short stories my death diary my response videos what do y'all like to see what's y'all's cup of tea if it really is just for honor uh, get be specific what about for honor do you like do you like my heroes in history do you like my for honor analysis videos what do you enjoy seeing from me the most let me know in the comment section i'd really love to hear your thoughts and uh, that about does it, guys. Like I said, really short update video, but wanted to get this out to you guys. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already. really helps the channel out. Um, I'll leave my Discord link in the description box. Um, leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and don't forget to comment down below. I, ev I read every comment, even if I don't always reply, because I'm just a busy, busy guy. All right, guys. Again, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video, which should be hopefully soon. Thank you, guys. Talk to you later. Bye. その間、鍵穴に目を近づけるのはいけないことでしょうか。お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お